Hello fellow grave crawlers, and welcome to ZTV Games. I am your host, Paper Zombie, who is glad to finally be back with you. Who knew that a routine trip to the dentist would give me a free infection that got into my system and tried to kill me again? Yeah, that was great, but luckily I've been able to recover. Hopefully we're over last weekend snafus with the stream getting dropped and everything else. And now I can finally go ahead and bring you guys the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, which has now been live for about three weeks and a couple of days, I believe so. So if you guys watched the tech test when I did that, then everything is basically the same with a few minor tweaks, the inclusion of all the characters and the ability to level up your character and choose perks. So, um... Unfortunately, in this game, there still is no offline bot or versus AI mode. So that means in order to learn how to play, you have to do it live. You don't get to cheat and you can't go into any of those modes. So there is there's a there's tutorials that you can go into and they'll teach you what to do and everything. And they'll show you how to play your characters. But nothing beats straight up hardcore experience. So that's what i'm actually going to be doing for this um because i feel like we can't have enough character guys at this point there's so many different ways to make characters and there's so different many ways to spec them so for this episode we're going to go ahead and focus on the family side of the game and its characters so let's go ahead and dive in because uh, we got a lot to cover and we got a short amount of time so So first and foremost, here's your victims. You remember all of them. Pretty much all the victims that were in before are in now. So you didn't get any extra victims. However, you've got two new family members. We had Face before, we had Cook before, and we had Hitchhiker before. New to the program is Johnny and Sissy. Now where do they fit in? We know that Face is always in the basement and he's our big DPS slash tank. We know that Cook is our seeker because this game is pretty much hide and seek, like a top notch hardcore version of hide and seek. So he is a seeker and he's best with tracking people down and locking things down. Your hitchhiker, on the other hand, is going to be a chaser. He's going to be the person who's out there chasing, and currently he has traps that he could put down. But unfortunately, the traps aren't as cool as they were before, um, because people know about them now. They stick out like sore thumbs, so he kind of doesn't really have much going for him anymore like he did before. So, um, yeah. Johnny is going to be your... I guess the best thing to call him is a DPS chaser, but he's not quite a chaser because unlike Hitchhiker who could go through uh, crawl spaces and shimmy spaces, Johnny cannot. Neither can Cook. So Johnny can't go through those. I don't even think he can, uh, I don't even think he can shut off crawl spaces. So pretty much his whole ability is that he can track footprints. So he's supposed to be a tracker, a lot like the cook, but he just tracks in a different way. So I haven't had, I haven't gotten a chance to spend any time with Johnny. So yeah. Then we got Sissy, the only female of the pack so far. This one, she takes and she's another chaser, just like the hitchhiker. What she does is she has poison. She can spray a poison cloud out and anyone who walks into it gets poisoned. And it also buffs up her weapon so that she can, when she attacks, she poisons a person. And her poison has effects that you can go ahead and attach to it. I hope they add more effects in the future, but for right now, you can make it to where when you hit them with the poison attack, it slows the person you're chasing down so you can get to them. As you can see, she is not about DPS. She is not a damage dealer. She is a chaser, but she's not about damage, but most of your chasers aren't about damage. 
they're just about being able to stay on somebody and literally being able to wear them down slowly as they keep being able to chase them. However, where she differs from Hitchhiker is that her blood harvesting is higher. So she is going to be able to hold more blood to feed for grandpa. So that's her background thing that she's good at. So those are all of our characters for right now. If we have time, we'll do some Johnny and some Sissy. But for right now, we're going to be doing the three main ones just like before. We got Face, Cook, and Hitchhiker. So rather than go over all the perks and everything um, separately, I'll just go over them as we play. So how it's set up is that you pick your character and then you go to your loadouts. This is where you get to choose your abilities and your perks. So this is your special ability, which for face is his chainsaw. So I need to actually reset this because it actually changed my thing. So I'm actually going to go a different way with him. His whole thing is based off of his chainsaw. So when you play his face, he's hard to kind of get used to because he has his chainsaw mechanic. And so what you kind of have to do is figure out what it is that you want to get out of that chainsaw. Because the special ability is that when you run, you hold the chainsaw over your head. And as you're holding this chainsaw over your head, you get, you get to the point to where you get faster. But if it stalls out on you, then you have to wait for the cooldown before you can restart it. So, and it looks like YouTube is already trying to throw attitude. So I don't know why. Okay, now hopefully that's working better. Okay, so. So it's saying I'm at two, but it's not giving me two. Okay, so what we want to do with this is reduce this chance of overheat, reduce this chance of overheat, reduces the overheat cooldown time. So this is the cooldown for a restart. And it seems like whenever I go to this screen, YouTube acts up. So I'm going to have to figure that out and do it fast. So I don't know why YouTube is tripping out. I guess just certain screens it doesn't like. 10% more can be used 20% more before stalling. 20%. Alright, let's let's take this. And it can be used 20% more before stalling. And then this is from excessive revving. Let's go with that. And then we'll see how that looks. If it looks, if, if it ain't working, we'll come back and we'll fix it. So these are where your perks will go. Each of your perks do different things. For him right now, I am running a setup where I am, because I like to be a basement dweller with him. His goal is he starts in the basement. So mainly you wanna stay in the basement and lurk in the basement and try and take out people in the basement. And even if they all leave the basement, the reason why you wanna stay down there is because on some maps, there's key items that are down there. And if they fall back down wells, you'll be able to catch them. So that's what you want. So this is what his this spec is built for, is for him to catch people who fall down and back into the basement. So, Victims who climb down wells will be highlighted for 12 seconds. I think this perk is broken because it doesn't work all the time. So I'm going to keep working with it and we'll see. And then to support that, I also get well, 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 which is victims that jump down wells take 50% more damage. So it's not a good idea to do that with him. So that's how he's set up. Everybody else is set up good. Yeah, we got our ear. And then he's set up. He just needs his grandpa talent put back on. Okay. All right, so let's go ahead and let's get started, shall we? So we're gonna go at random. We'll see who I get first. Because unfortunately, you don't get to pick who you wanna be. 
you kind of just come in and you hope that you can get your character or you hope that that character becomes selectable and that you can just snatch him up. So we'll see. Let's jump in. Then you get quick match, which chooses which side you are going to be on. So quick match, you can either be family or victim. Family means you get specifically family. You get to choose from them, victim, specifically victim. And then you can also create private lobbies. So we're going with family. So let's get to it. All right, so because our Leatherface is so low level, he doesn't have a grandpa talent. And our Johnny, I don't think he's even fixed his, so. This might be an interesting match. So, I'll go ahead and ready up. All right, so with our hitchhiker, what our objective is gonna be is to go around and make sure that we trap everything because we only get three traps to hold on us. So we wanna go ahead and make sure that we are trapping the major objectives. We've got two, we got a battery and a generator that we need to trap. And then our third trap is probably gonna go towards the fuse to keep them from opening the fuse exit. And then we'll just kinda patrol the area so we'll see how it goes hopefully we'll be able to do our thing hitchhiker his patrol is mainly on the outside because we don't have a cook cook would mainly be patrolling on the inside i would switch to cook but i don't trust the johnny so it's been too many johnny players that come in and they just suck because they don't understand how to play johnny yet so and that's what I like about the game is everybody is still in the learning phase. So everybody is still discovering stuff and such. Unfortunately, you may see cheaters. That was a big thing that happened with this game, unfortunately, is that it got hit by cheaters. But that was because of some bad decisions that the developers made when it came to some things. So they're trying to work that out. But as it stands right now, crossplay is disabled for PC. So PC can only hook up with other PC players and Xbox Game Pass players. Which are supposed to be the cause of all of this because they didn't have anti-cheat on their system, but Steam did. So we can see where the issue is right there. But um, as of right now, while they're figuring that out, 
um, crossplay is disabled for PC. So PC can only play with PC. I can't play with Xbox or PS5 players right now. So hopefully this is going to get fixed and they'll get it all worked out and we'll be able to move forward from there. But we'll see. So that's just something to be aware of if you're on a PC platform is that, yeah, you won't get to play with everybody else for right now. Adolescent vandals have been terrorizing the city of Lexington, Texas with horrific depictions of famine and the macabre. Nearby active officers may involve remote Odessa sheriffs, investigating evidence authorities locally intercepted years ago. The grotesque animal dioramas, the post of fox boats, have appeared in the city, yet their connection is unknown. Here's our generator, just like it was in the tech test, it's still in the same spot. All right, now we're gonna go hit this back battery. This is your family focus, so you can see what everybody else is doing. The other white outlines are grandpa, that's Johnny, and then the other one you saw is uh, Leatherface. Johnny boy. Ah. And as you guys know, Grandpa's whale still does the sonar, where if the victims are moving, it'll track them. So I've got to hurry. Grandpa taught me this little trick. Because I need to get inside. I need to get to that fuse box before they do. They're just moving faster than I am. Hello, dear. Come on out here. There you go, sweet pea. Take a little bit of that. Now. Okay, so Johnny can close those. Awesome. All right, let's hit. All right, we're heading upstairs to hit this fuse. There you are. We're not going to have that. So we need to trap this. We have to. And now my mission, should I choose to accept it, is going to be to patrol this area and outside. We're going to latch that so that they can't just sneak in through here. Yeah, because I only get three. Okay. Is this door open? Good. Okay, cool. 
Okay, you guys are in the house. So that means I need to be outside. Keep that upstairs together, guys. Please. So what I want to do is I want to cover this, the generator, just as before. You want to cover your Jennies. Make sure that's still operating. And then you want to cover your battery. Now the bad news is that there is no shortcut. So, and because we don't have our face staying down in the basement where he belongs, which is okay for face to come on up and do his thing, but once he's done that, he should go ahead and go on back down into the basement so that we can send customers to visit. All right, nobody's been here. All right, I'm running out of stamina. Let's go ahead and let's collect our blood. So we can feed that to Paw Paw. All right, we just had a player disconnect. Don't know why, but okay. All right, since Papa is at level zero, he needs blood. Let's speed this along. And if you guys remember from the tech test, you need to give him blood to activate his powers. We need his mighty sonar. All right, so I'm gonna shimmy through here. Ah, somebody better, okay, face, good, good. Johnny, I see you, good. That means you guys are up there doing what you need to do. Keep that area straight. Because unfortunately the victims can get outside just from other exits, so that's why somebody needs to be outside to make sure that they don't. I see you. Chaser. Go get her. Make sure that door ain't open. Good. That means you crawled up. You should not have done that. Found you, honey. All right, what the heck? Yeah, you're not opening that gate fast enough. You're not gonna do that. All right, face, you should be down in the basement handling business. Instead, you're up here trying to do my job. I hear you. I just don't know where you are. Where is... There you are. There's the fuse. Gotta stay on top of that. Ah, looks like they already got to it. 
or try to. All right. That's Johnny. Okay, good. So, Face just took the door off. He said, skip it. Ain't gonna be no mess. Make sure our doors are good. Make sure that door is shut. Make sure we're all good here. Let's do a tour outside, shall we? Someone's here. I can hear you, I just don't know where you are. But I know you're here. Where are you? Ah! Gotta get back. Gotta get back. He's about to activate that fuse. And we're gonna be screwed if he does. I'm not gonna be fast enough. people everybody's here okay Coming back up through here, love. I'm gonna let Face handle it because there's only gonna be one place she's going to try and come up at. And I'm going to be paying attention just to be sure she doesn't do it. That door is closed. Is it closed? No, it's not. Close that door. But you, you're going to come up right here. I know you are. All right, let's go hit that trap. Okay. I can get with that. Drop her. 
Now that was her fault for jumping out the window. Base, do the dance of happiness. All right. So as you can see, you don't get a whole lot in the way of XP. You have to kind of kill somebody and hope that you get some. But yeah, so Johnny was our best one. The bleed outs were the ones that fell down into the well because they got shanked. But that's what you do as Hitchhiker. So yep, so we were able to keep that map together. Very good, very, very good. We were able to keep everything locked down, all the objectives, as you can see, that fuse, you have to watch that fuse. And you have to be careful because the fuse can be in different places. But just use your family sense and your family sense will tell you exactly where it is. Ooh. Oh, we got a good face. And I'm looking at his abilities. So he's got Tacker Trag, just like me. Very good. He's got Violent at level 3, just like me. Oh, yes, we're taking this. Our cook is built for blood. So he is our blood collector. We're on Slaughterhouse Day. Okay, we got this. Oh, face must not like Slaughterhouse. That is a hard map to play. It's a very hard map to play. Yeah, we'll wait. Because if all of us are hooked up, if a face doesn't start, then it'll actually put, well, no, because we don't have a leather face, it won't start the game for us. But there's a strange mechanic that they have in where the game will start with six out of seven players. So you don't want that. A lot of people do not like playing face. So I guess our cook said, fine, I'll do it. Nah, dude, you look like you were a good cook and had a good cook spec. That's a shame. And a lot of reasons why people don't like to play face is because uh, it is a bit difficult. And if you get caught up by cheaters, then you will just get... You better be good. You better be good. Somebody can request to swap with you if you haven't selected the character. So he wants to be Hitchhiker. I'm going to let him do that. We're going to need somebody who's collecting blood for this because ain't none of them doing it. So here we go. So now we'll be playing a different character. And we're on Slaughterhouse, so yeah, I got a whole lot of things to do. We'll go over them while I'm talking about them, while I do them. The Sheriff's Department says Maria Flores, a native of Uvalde, was last seen near the town of Newt. The vehicle was recently discovered abandoned, with officials reporting no signs of foul play. Authorities are hopeful that the expanded search to the nearby communities of Marlow and Chinatown will unearth new leads. Family and friends are urging anyone with information regarding her disappearance to please come forward. Authorities were alerted to Helm's Ranch yesterday to investigate reports of cattle abuse, but what they found instead was disturbingly serene. The ranch was devoid of livestock. First things first. With him, pad, lock, stuff to keep people out. Now, people used to padlock that. I just padlock the door. All right. Let's use these blood talents. 
so we can get pop off some blood. All right. All right. Get him. A hitchhiker, I'm going to need you to go over there and hit that battery, too. Good. He's already on his way to go get that done. Perfect. All right, where's the rest of our blood at? Wait a minute. All right, Papa, let's hook you up. See, and I built myself to do this. This is why I gave myself the perks so that I could feed Grandpa. That's it. Tastes good, don't it? All right, let's break this down. Okay, cool. Thought I was gonna have to shank you. All right, let's gather some more blood so we can get all of our abilities on. Good, very good. All right. Gotcha. Hello, dear. I thought I sensed you. Let me go close this door. So, Cook, unfortunately, you can have all the stamina in the world, but he's not very fast. Get him. This punk probably went down the whale. Yep, I see him down there. All right, cool. So that's my subtask right now, is that I'm just gathering blood. Crap. How? They went out through the back door. No. I know what they did. Wherever that fuse is at, they activated the fuse. The fuse is right here, though. That had to be fused. Yep. All fuse exit. All fuse exit. Now you guys see why I trap the fuse so much when I'm a hitchhiker? That's the reason why. And they put the fuse in such an obvious area. And I thought I heard it get activated. You do get little noises when certain things activate. And I thought I heard that activate. Because it doesn't tell you when doors are open. Which it should. Because then if you know that the doors are open, then you can go down there and you can at least do something about it. So. 
yeah, Slaughterhouse is one of those maps to where they can get you. So I've never seen the fuse be right there next to Grandpa. Like, that was kind of raggedy that they just put it right there. But that's just for me to know next time so that I'll be able to at least come in. So I'll at least be able to come in and um, I'll, I'll keep that on my lookout. And since none of them wants to be Leatherface, it's time for me to go. You'll get that a lot. A lot of people do not want to play face. And that's just because as it stands right now, he gets bullied. Especially if you have a Leland in the match. Because one thing is to always know your victims. The only two that you need to be completely concerned about is Leland, Julie, and Connie. That's why you will always see a Leland and a Connie in every single freaking match that you will see tonight. You will always say Leland and you will always see Connie. Why is that? Leland has an easy mode button, which pretty much allows him to sucker punch anybody. It's not supposed to work on Leatherface, but for some strange reason, it does. And he can sucker punch anybody. And if he sucker punches you, you get knocked down and you have to stay there for 10 seconds. You can't move. You can't do anything. You're out of control of your character. 10 seconds is more than enough time for somebody to be able to trigger something and escape. So, you don't like to see him come and see. What did I say? Leland and Connie, always main staples. Connie, the reason why people don't like her is because she's got lock picking abilities. She makes Jill Valentine sit back and take notes. That's how good she is. No, sweetheart. No. Not tonight. Let's see. I hear you, little punks. I know where you are. There you go. Get them, guys. Okay. I'm gonna run out of stamina. face I wouldn't do that if I were you sweetness
Ah, I know where you went. Yeah, I found you. I see you. Can't run from me. I'm fixing to find you on that for sure. Ho. Ha ha, you missed. Okay. Here's how we end that. I can't count on no one around here. Better get to it. And no, this is not your easy escape route place to just go through. No, honey. I've got you. Do not slow me down, dude. What are you doing? Stop cheating. You can't run from me. There are plenty who have tried. Never turns out well. Alright, where is this fuse at? I have yet to see the fuse box, dude. Uh huh. Ah. Gotcha. Pop out. Take this now. It'll Power up. up. Make sure this door is not open. Good. All right. Face. Quiet on the restaurant front, except for over there. Right there. Alright, let's power up Pawpaw. 
commencing to secondary task. Collect blood. Let's go check over here and make sure this door isn't closed up. I see you, boy. Get him. Excellent job. Don't get out through here. All right, let's bring this game to an end. Let's take Papa all the way up to full. So where'd you run to that fast? There you are. Get him. Awesome. Magnificent, guys. We double teamed him. We double teamed him. No matter what, my hitchhiker was on me like nobody's business. Love him. Do the dance of joy. Now, what happened with that is something that can happen with uh, um, when you're dealing with a struggle. If you are dealing with a struggle, whoever is locked in the struggle with the survivor is locked in the struggle with the survivor. If another killer comes up, they have a they actually have a one hit kill shot at that survivor. So, luckily, my hitchhiker was there both times. The first time, I helped him. The second time, he helped me. So, yeah, it's always good to have a backup because he was able to come in and get that one hit, one, one hit, one hit kill because I had her wrapped up. So, yeah. That was a good team. I'd like to keep them. I'd like to keep them. Thank you. It's too bad I can't. But yeah, that's what you do with Cook. As you can see, I was taking it. Actually, I'm going to back out of this just to explain what you guys just saw. Um, as Cook, I was standing there using my ear. And 
once you get used to the ability, you can kind of start to tell where people may or may not be. Like if it starts zooming in, then it disappears. It's a good chance that somebody is probably over in that direction. So it's best to run over there and check it out. Now, Cook is somebody who needs to actually be on comms and needs to be on voice so that he's telling people what he sees and where they are. Unfortunately, on PC, for whatever reason, they're having issues with that stuff working. So I haven't gotten mine to work yet. So unfortunately, I can't do anything about that until I get my cook up to rank three with his special power in which anytime I pick up somebody, it highlights it for all the other family members to see. So until I get to that point, the only thing that I can do is just scare the family members into knowing that somebody's watching them, like that old Rockwell song. And uh, that's how you keep pressure on. So yeah, that's what you saw me doing with the ear and everything else and then with my padlocks lock all the areas down if they want to take and shimmy through things you make it to where they shimmy into an area that's not useful for them and then there's only one way in and one way out and that's how me and that hitchhiker we were able to catch her now i messed up by opening the gate luckily she didn't go through it i should have left the gate closed and just went over to that uh spot where she could crawl back through and shank her kind of like how i did at the end so yeah so yeah, that's how you work together with your family. Teamwork is actually more necessary on family than it is with victims. Victims, you guys can go into a game and just act like nobody else exists and just do your own thing. Family, it's pivotal we work together. And that match, that last match, was a perfect example of how we work together. So yeah. Alright, let's set it up for another one. So as you all can see, we're going to talk about Face for just a moment. He actually has what's called the, the full DPS build. Now the bad news about that build is that it is very stamina costly and dependent. You only get maybe about two or three swings with your weapon before you're out of stamina and then you're standing there looking like an idiot. So it's a good build if you're accurate, but Face is horrible when it comes to accuracy so you kind of have to work that out on your own i don't run dps i don't run that dps spec with face i run a different type of dps spec with him so we'll be seeing him later on Thank 
periodic her disappearance to please come forward. I'm not a violent man. This is something I gotta do. I'll make it snappy, I promise. It's gonna be much more for the worse if the others find you, I promise you that. Can't focus. Hoorah! Wait a minute. Always remember to stand here and wait for it to close. Because it will activate but not close sometimes. It's kinda stupid. Base, where you at? Okay, he's still in the basement. Ah, I see you. All right, we will need to watch this. All right, Papa, let me help you out. Proceeding to secondary task, blood collection. Okay, I can't go that way. Like, they should never have those kinds of barriers up here like that. Okay, somebody already got that one. Somebody's in there. That's what I'm doing, partner. What you doing? Somebody's in here. Check our doors. Face, Johnny, where are you guys at? All right. Face, who are you chasing? No one's been this way. Hi, dear. If you just listen, I wouldn't have to do this. Get her, Johnny. Just wait until I get my level three ear. I'll be tattling and telling on all you my fives. Just wait. Uh-oh. Sounds like she met face.
magnificent. Nobody's there. She's trying to go for gold. Damn. I can't get to her. I can't get to her, dude. See, I hate this. I hate that they put these stupid things in the way and there's... Okay, good. There's a way. You're not doing that. I'm gonna find you. Now, always beware if you're playing cook, if you are around loud things like this stupid generator, it will pull your attention toward that generator and give you essentially a false read. I see you. You might have run in here, but you ran into the wrong place. Always collect blood. Secondary task. Oh yeah, that's the way I need to get in and out. I'ma smack that Johnny upside his doggone head. This is all his doing. And unfortunately, you cannot re-padlock a door after you've already padlocked it, which I think is stupid. So that's something that they need to change for him. As long as as long as there's no padlock on it, even if it's already been destroyed. Alright, Papa. Time to gather blood and make this business happen. Cool. I can't count on no one around here. Better get to it. Now I don't know who fed him. Who was around here? Johnny? Johnny. There you are. All right. Let's give him his last drop, level 5. Pawpaw's at full power. Oh. There you are. I knew I'd find you. You go that way, I'm going this way. I knew she was out there. 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 You guys saw me go out there to go get her. I knew she was out there. But I couldn't see her and I just couldn't find her. But I knew she was out there. Dang face. Face dropped everybody. 
Right on. Now, Johnny, I don't know how the hell you got so much experience for doing nothing. Well, he is probably tracking. But the tracking didn't help him see where that last one went. So, dang. It's all right, though. It's all right. We only had one that escaped. That's okay. That's okay. Because three died. One escaped. You always have to have one that lives to go tell the tale. Of what they witnessed that one night. And you better hope we don't come to your neighborhood and find out where you are. And snatch you up like Jason did the one girl. <laughs> it's the only time he's ever left Crystal Lake. Believe it or not. Hilarious. Beginning of Friday the 13th, part two. That's the only time he leaves Crystal Lake and then all of a sudden he just clips right back to Crystal Lake and it's like, yay, Friday the 13th movie. But what was that stuff in the city? That almost looked like Halloween. Kind of was. And I don't think they wanted to step on that. All right, let's go. Hey, 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 God. Oh, y'all ain't got no talents. Uh, no, 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 hell no. You guys have no talents. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I love them and it was all beautiful, but they were brand new. They didn't have no pawpaw talents and they were coming in as brand new and fresh. No. <laughs> I don't need a team like that right now. I'm not trying to carry nobody. Oh my goodness. But you gotta start somewhere, right? You gotta start somewhere. So man, it seems like you guys have all seen me at my best. Like I used to be a bomb hitchhiker. I still am, but... Just when it comes to those traps, they're garbage now. Oh, okay. You all know what time it is, right? Okay, first of all, I'm not doing a match with a Johnny and a Sissy. Because it looks like you have all the hacked perks. Suspiciously, for Sissy. I will not. If I wanted to see that sissy in there, I would have picked face. But, I'm sorry. Sissy, unfortunately, sissy is jacked up, like I said, because one of her talents is messed up right now. Just like for a hitchhiker, placing his traps. You remember, you guys remember that uh, opening that I kept standing nearby that people were crawling out of? If you place a hitchhiker trap near there, it could potentially bug a victim. So that's why I don't do it. Now, I saw that other guy did it, and it's supposed to be something that a hitchhiker can do. But as of right now, it's bugging people. So it'll bug the character. They can't crawl through crawl spaces. Pretty much it incapacitates their character. So, okay. Did, 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 did. Okay. Let's do it. All right, face. We're going to be watching your back. Johnny, I hope you're good. I hope you do not suck. I wish we had a hitchhiker or a sissy on here. The search continues in Muerto County. But we shall see. University of Texas student, the sheriff's department says Maria Flores, a native of Uvalde, was last seen near the town of Newt. A vehicle was recently discovered abandoned with officials reporting no signs of foul play. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody do a job right but me around here. I tell you what.
I can't count on no one around here. Better get to it. We all know this routine, right? But I can't stand by. We got jobs to do. And I got locks to put. All right, so we got somebody from there. The cool thing is that as cook, when you're on this map, you have a whole lot of points that you're able to watch from a central location. And we can help Papa power up really fast. Close it down. All right, let's check our spot. All right, good. Shouldn't be messing with that. All right, I've exhausted all my blood in the house. We'll have to head upstairs. Let's go check, just to be sure. Let's scare him. Face, there you are. I saw that chainsaw clip through the door. I was like, face, is that you? How's that ability on cooldown? I ain't never used a freaking ability. Johnny. What you doing, buddy? Why are you walking in place? Why is this ability on? Oh, shoot, we're locked. Look. Everybody, take a look. None of my stuff is powering back up. Oh, no. We got cheaters. All right. Well, it don't matter, because I can't interact. I can't do nothing. Okay. Well, I'm only going I'm going to block the only door you can go out of. That's what you better do. <laughs> ah, I hate when you have cheaters. You had cheaters. So yeah, but you know what? Shoot, we were doing pretty good to only come across one group one cheater so far. 
so that's not a problem. Let's just hope because as the hours grow later, more and more cheaters start to show up. That's what I've learned, especially once you get to like 10, 11, 12 o'clock in, in the morning. Oh. No. Nope, I ain't doing it. Well, we need a hitchhiker, dude. We need a hitchhiker on this map because guess what? We're gonna need a face. So if you wanna be cook, turn in the cook, do your thing. All right, I've got my well built. We're on the family house. We got Sissy. The only reason why I don't like Sissy is just because, man, Sissies don't know how to play. Like, they don't know how to chase. They just think, hey, I'm just going to blow my poison and it's just going to destroy everybody in sight. Horrible chasers. So horrible that you're selecting a ability that is already selected. One thing to know, double grandpa abilities don't help you. So we're going to go with proximity alarm because what this is going to do is block anybody. Proximity alarm means that any critical doors that get open, I'll notice. Anyone who falls down a well, extra damage. For cook, locks take longer. So you always want to have different grandpa abilities. You don't want to double stack up because double stacking up does not help you. It'll just get considered as the same talent and it'll just leave a space open. So you always want to make sure that you have at least three good grandpa talents. And a lot of people will be like, don't choose the grandpa talents. Just choose the best because when you have grandpa talents, they all get assigned at random for when they get activated. So the more blood you feed grandpa, the more they get activated. Our cook is not using a blood spec. Our sissy is not using a blood spec. So you can best believe that grandpa is not gonna get a whole lot of loving this match. So it's not always about damage, it's about utility sometimes. So that's going to be an uphill struggle for us, especially because I'm a basement dweller. Now, because we are on the family house, I will come upstairs once to destroy all the stuff that's upstairs. But then after that, I'll go back down into the basement and wait for people to fall down the well so I can shank them. Please stand by.
search continues in Muerto County for a missing University of Texas student. The Sheriff's Department says Maria Flores, a native of Uvalde, was last seen near the town of Newt. The vehicle was recently discovered abandoned, with officials reporting no signs of foul play. Authorities are hopeful that the expanded search nearby Marlow and Chinatown will unearth new leads. Family and friends. Okay, good. I didn't get bum rushed at the start. First off, start your chainsaw. Run for it. Destroy the door. Me, I destroy all doors. So that way, they can't get slammed on you. Explore our areas because you actually get good control on family map where you start at. Destroy any areas that they have in. Ain't no easy access. And now that's your rev. That right there, that's your rev. We're gonna destroy it. Now some people say this is a bad idea. I don't believe that. There we go. I know where you went. All right, so now is the time for me to run up here and hit this second floor. I need to go destroy everything here and I need to be quick. I'm talking like two shakes of a lamb's tail type of quick. Okay, everything is locked down. Where are you? There you are. Get this punk. Come on. Come on, Lipshin. Let's take you on over here. Let's make an example out of you. Special execution. The basement open is ex. The. <laughs> <laughs> the basement exit is open. 
Oh shoot. I'm like, where's my where's my charge? Oh That door is open. The door is open. See, this is what you need to destroy. See, and this is where they came in at. I'm going back to the basement. It's up to y'all to handle this business. Yeah. You thought she was going to get out. to me. If you come down to this basement, it's just like Catwoman said, hell here. Somebody needs to be up there protecting the fuse. I can't do everything. Now, sissy, you need to have your silly ass up there protecting the frickin' fuse. Why are you down here in my territory? If that's what you want to do, stay. I'll guard the fuse. Because sissy is going to make me slap the hell out of her. Man, it's a switch right here. And then it's this right here. 
I know how they escaped. They got out. Ooh, level. Man, I got the most points out of them two, and they were teamed up, and they still sucked. West Road, that means somebody got out through the front because our sissy was not paying attention. That's why I said I don't like, I don't like sissy, dude. A lot of people who play her do not know what they need to do. It's like if you play sissy, your role is essentially the same thing as hitchhiker. If you can't do that, don't play sissy. Know your role. We're not doing sissy again. We're out. I don't want to see sissy. I don't want sissy. I'm so tired of sissy. Unless I see a good high level sissy, no. I'm sorry. There's too many people that do not know how to play as her. And then run and then you, you try and give those people the benefit of the doubt. But it's like, when it comes to family, you guys have to work together and be on your P's and Q's. If you are not, you will get jacked up. Okay. All right, so we need a better talent. I'm thinking for this one, less well, 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 more proximity alarm. Any important door open is good. So we'll be able to see those with our grandpa perk. All right, we got that, we got that, and we got that. Okay, Cook, I'm sorry. Did we take too long for you? Oh, he doesn't want to deal with a level zero. Dealing with all these 20s. Okay, I refuse to wait. I'll wait. I'll wait. Okay, for gas station, let's see, for Papa Talents, because <sighs> dang, we don't have a cook, and I'm not playing with Sissy, sorry, I'm not playing with Sissy, we already had two DPS, you don't need to be one of them, we need a support, we need a cook, not a Sissy. We don't need two of you that do the same thing. And one of you is going to suck at it. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I've been playing this long enough to know that when you see a certain team of a certain composition, it's just not going to work. You gotta have pieces like this. Perfect. I'm with you. Let's rock. Sheriff's Department says Maria Flores, a native of Uvalde, was last seen near the town of Newt. Her vehicle was recently discovered abandoned, with officials reporting no signs of foul play. Authorities are hopeful that the expanded search will unearth the Family and friends are urging anyone with information regarding her disappearance to please come forward. The scheduled draining of the Colton
chainsaw stall. So now I'm on the cooldown. So I can't start it back up. Okay, where did she go? She was down here and then she just disappeared. Okay, she's clipping like nobody's business, dude. Ain't nobody fed Pawpaw. Like, what the hell are the other two doing? What are y'all doing? upstairs thing.
die. It's enough of that. Do the dance of happiness. I think we got them all. Except for one who escaped from the West Road, but everybody got one kill each. Magnificent. And I don't know why she thought she was gonna try and sneak in. Dude, if you hear a chainsaw on the other end of the door, don't go through that door, you stupid. Oh, that was great. So now you see why I like to go up to that second floor once they get out because I could just close off all their areas. And that's the only area that I go to and then I go back downstairs. Like that's what I do. Okay, so we got two killers. That, that, and proximity alarms. That should help us. Especially because he ain't got no kind of tracker. And she ain't got no kind of tracker. So. This is jacking up my spec. But we'll go with it. Because I'll still see them if they fall down the whales. As long as the talent decides it wants to work. I'm gonna go with proximity alarms just because I wanna know when doors are open. Because this is a very critical map. That's why nobody likes to play face on this map.
All right, so on this map, pretty much my objective is to stay basically where I'm at. There should never be a button that makes you turn off your ability. It's just stupid. I'm a little bit screwed because I don't know this map, but I know I need to stay here. If I don't do nothing else, I need to stay right here. And nope, you don't have easy access to it. Sorry. You won't have that. Remember in the previous match where they activated the steam pump? Yeah, this is how they do that. It's right here. Down in the basement. So that's why I need to be down here on this map to guard this. Because it will get used. Keep them doors closed.
trying to gather points. Ah, good. Violin is activated. Why are you guys down here, dude? I got this. You should be topside. Handle that. Two have escaped. He's about to get shanked, love. I got this. I got this. I don't need you down here. I got this. I need you guys to be topside. I got this. I got this. They come back down here, they die. I got this. You guys need to be topside. See, I should have took my sissy talent. Because I do have a talent for face. With her, where when she sprays her poison cloud, I get a poison attack. I should have set that one up. Nope. it ain't gonna happen baby ain't gonna happen Really? So you can just keep doing that? Really? So you can just keep doing that? So you can just keep doing that. You're not gonna win. You're not gonna win. Oh, you try. Oh, you try.
Wow. Okay, so you guys just saw that, right? You guys just saw that. She was able to come up and stab me all to death. I am going to send this to the devs so that they can see how easy it is for survivors to just do that. Now, do I seem the least bit scariest to you when somebody can just, some chick who ain't got no skills can just come up to me and just club me in the back? That's why you die. And she could just come up and club me in the back and do that over and over and over again. That's why nobody likes to be faced. Dance of happiness. We got one that got away. One that got away. Oh, we got two that got away. Yeah. But you guys saw that. That is the reason why nobody likes to play face. Is because he is not supposed to be able to get stunned by anyone. But he can be stunned by everybody. No matter what. Like his whole thing is that he's not supposed to be stunned because he's supposed to be the basement patroller and stuff. So he's supposed to be unstunnable. But they haven't fixed their stuff to make him unstunnable yet and it seems like that's not on their priority list so a lot of people don't like to play face because you can get stun locked like you just saw and you saw how long that stun was that was long enough for her to stun me let's back out so i can break this down that was long enough for her to stun me Go to a bone pile. Pick out another bone. Come back and stun me again while I'm trying to turn the thing off. Go back, pick up another bone. And stun me again. So essentially, she was able to stop me from turning that off because all she was a all she had to do it was a shorter amount of time for her to go get that stuff out the bone shard before my stun lock was over. So that's why a lot of people don't like to play face because he's not supposed to be susceptible to stuns, but he's the most susceptible to them. And if you get caught down there and it's either an Ana that's going to do it or it's either a Leland that's going to do it. Ana is going to do it because she has a talent that allows her to resist damage. So essentially she can take anything that will one hit kill a normal person and shrug it off like it ain't nothing as long as her talent is active. But... I thought this game was supposed to be something where survivors were supposed to be scared and had limited resources. For her to be able to stun me, go to a bone pile, pick out another, because it's a mini game involved in the bone pile. Pick up another bone, come back, stab me again, which put me into another stun. Meanwhile, the gas is just activating and going. So my thing is, if victims aren't supposed to be able to have that kind of power, why did you give it to them? Why did you give it to them? And a lot of people don't like to play face because that's where you see all of those issues compounded. Now you got to see me do some hot stuff with face. I got to pick up people. I got to do a special kill. But in the end, you also got to see me face what it is that is his worst problem. And you haven't even seen it when I faced it at its worst. That was the worst at its best. The worst at its worst, you guys would have been rolling on the floor laughing like, dude, this shit looks like some stuff at a Scooby-Doo. <laughs> Excuse my language, but y'all would have been like, this looks like some mess out of Scooby-Doo. The hits, the knockdowns, the runs, everything else. So yeah, 
that's why nobody likes to play face because as it stands right now he's not the behemoth that he was in the tech test he's just a great big fluffy puppy and everybody always says oh but he has a one hit kill do you know how you have to set your up set yourself up to do a one hit kill first of all your chainsaw has to be maxed out which is hard to do and then hit a strike second of all that strike can be dodged and it's very easy to dodge because that strike does not have a wide arc third if you miss that strike it charges you out and you have to stand there like an idiot until you're able to recharge your chainsaw so yeah that's why a lot of people do not like to play face so man we've seen everybody we got to see some good matches with face we got to see some good matches with cook and we got to see some good matches with hitchhiker so we need at least one more outro match and it's not gonna be with face because now it's starting to get into the later hours and once we hit those later hours we start dealing with people who know how to exploit him to the dobius maximus and we don't want that so yeah yeah and it's funny because they make him require for every match but he's the easiest one to destroy. He's the easiest one to kill. Like you stop him, he just stands there and he's just like an idiot, but it's crazy. It's crazy. So, okay. Let's go ahead and let's do a victory lap. Sign in. So I hope this tutorial has been helpful for all of you guys. Um, as you can see, certain perks you take, if you wanna do blood perks, that's for your blood harvesting to help defeat grandpa. If you wanna do damage perks, that's to help you and your team out, and I am not playing face. That's over with. I'm not playing face no more. You have all ruined that for me tonight. So, the only difference between the builds is, do you want a DPS build, a utility build, or a blood build? So, and as you can see, the differences between all of them. So, we're going to give this more time. Like, trust me, this ain't the end. I am not face. Please stop it. Let me select this person like 800 times.
See how nobody wants to play face? Once I got to a certain time, did you notice? Yeah, it's a thing. See how quickly that one turned into hit sissy and hitchhiker and uh. no, 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 no. We need a good face. I'm a good face, but nobody likes to be him because pretty much what you do is as face, you're supposed to be the basement dweller. Unless you're on the family map, then you come up and destroy that stuff on the second floor and then go back down to the basement. That's what it's supposed to be. And I've got two DPSers, so yeah, I think we I, that might be it. That might be it for the evening. Because nobody wants to play him. And now you know why. And like I said, you guys saw the best of that. If you saw the worst of it, you would be like, why would anybody want to play face? I had a match where, because you have an extra cutscene as family. And during that cutscene, the victims have a chance to get free from their restraints. I had a match that started when I was face and before the match even started, I heard the grandpa noise. Then I was in my animation, you know, where I was standing there getting ready and there was a Leland behind me and he hit me. Then I came out of that animation and the Leland was still behind me, hit me again, and stunned me. Then I was like, okay, whatever. I kept going. The Leland came up again and hit me and stunned me. So I just quit the match because I was like, dude, if that's what you want to do, have at it. So... The only unfortunate thing is because we're all stuck on Alcatraz Island with cheaters. We don't know what's legit and what's not. So unfortunately, we don't know if Face is really weak or not, or if it's cheats that are allowing Leland to do what he does. But in any way, shape or form, Leland needs to be nerfed. He needs to be nerfed. There's no other way about that. Connie needs to be nerfed for her lockpicking ability. Like, give her her ability to where she can do one lockpick and be good. But, yeah, I think this is it, guys. I think this is it. Yeah, nobody's wanting to play face right now. And I'm not willing to do it myself. So I'll go, I hope you guys, uh, go, vowels and consonants are getting mixed up. I hope you guys all enjoy what you guys saw tonight. Um, I've been playing this for all three weeks and you guys saw me play this through the tech test. So hopefully I gave you a good roundabout for the first three characters, face, cook, and hitchhiker you've seen how to do with all three of them and you know the mission that you need to do and pretty much what has to be done and what abilities you have and how to spec yourself to do what you need to do we'll get deeper into this trust me we've got next Sunday and that's where we'll probably pick this up because I'd like to do this during the week, but schedule is probably not going to have that, and uh, I'd love, I'd love to. Trust me, I'd love to.
do this all week to got to show you guys everything to pick this all apart and just to enjoy it and have fun but that is not what's on the agenda so thank you all for joining me i appreciate it all 13 of you and anybody else who showed up i hope you guys learned something this was supposed to be a tutorial i hope it taught you about the characters what's going on with the game how to play them and how to use their talents remember this game allows you to do whatever you want to do how you want to do it to a certain extent and everything we're still not out of the first month this game is not even a month old yet and we're gonna pick it apart so i look forward to seeing you all next sunday when we will touch base with this game again and hopefully the saturday before we'll have some more terminator so thank you all for coming through i'm gonna go ahead and close things down for right now and I hope you learned. I hope it was informative. And the usual spiel. If it helped you guys out. Thumbs up it. And if it really helped you out. Subscribe to the station. Love to have you. We crawl the grays around here. We love to have you crawl the grays with us. So until next time. I am Paper Zombie. And I will see you next weekend have a good evening and watch out for the family <laughs>